Melissa Caddick's husband deleted text messages from his phone to hide from police that he smoked a joint with a friend the night his wife disappeared, her inquest has been told. Anthony Coletti told the court he drove to a friend's house on the evening of November 12, 2020, to get an e-cigarette. Watch the video above, Anthony Coletti drops Melissa Caddick bombshell. Watch the latest news on Channel 7 or stream for free on 7 Plus Was it in fact a smoke a joint? Counsel assisting Jason Downing SC asked. I don't know. It's possible, Coletti said. You must remember, Downing said. Let's just say I did, what's your point? Coletti said. On a night you told us you were conducting searches throughout the day. You in fact went to smoke a joint with a friend, Downing said. Coletti said he was concerned about his wife and accepted if he did smoke a joint it was to calm himself down. The text messages exchanged with that friend were later deleted by Coletti before he handed his phone over to police to assist with their inquiries, Downing said. Coletti said doing that must have had something to do with marijuana. He formally reported his wife missing the following day on November 13, and was asked if he had been out the night before. Not that I know of, he said. Coletti's evidence resumed on Thursday, after he was asked to step down on Wednesday due to his distress and confusion. Overnight he was receiving ongoing abusive messages including one via LinkedIn, his lawyer Judy Swan said. Dodgy prick, I hope you get locked up, it read. The day Coletti says his wife left their Dover Heights, Sydney, house and never returned, he texted her at 7. 16 am, are you okay? He wrote. Soon after this, he found her iPhone in their walk-in wardrobe, he confirmed on Thursday, which weirded him out because she never left home without her phone. At some point he noticed her keys, wallet, and a bag full of files were also left behind, but he said he can't recall when. The only thing I can vividly remember is the phone, he said. He didn't leave the home that morning before 7.30 am, he said, but was then referred to CCTV stills taken near the Dover Heights cliffs, previously shown and marked by Coletti in July last year. Caddick's black Mercedes appears to be in the photograph. This is me looking for Melissa can't confirm it's me but looks like me, Coletti has scrawled above his initials. The image is time-stamped at 6.55 a.m. on November 12. As you can see it's all a bit of a blur, Coletti says before adding his recollection is quite hazy. I don't recall going anywhere, he said that in several different police reports, and for weeks after his wife's disappearance, Coletti maintained Caddick left the home in black exercise gear and silver ASICs. But after she failed to return he says he assumed she was meeting with a lawyer, or staying in a hotel before her court appearance the following day. Downing asked why he insists she left an athletic wear if he later believed she was meeting with a lawyer. Coletti said it was based on assumptions, but denied seeing her wearing them. Meanwhile, Caddick's brother Adam Grimley has said in an affidavit the family was floored counsel assisting seemed to be going after his brother-in-law. He noted counsel seemed to be presenting unverified gossip as fact and said Coletti had suffered enormously from the loss of his wife, the shock of her misconduct and unsubstantiated accusations that followed.